kwa Facebook anasema si poko chukua zawadi kama amhusu mtu kama amhisi mtu au au amhisi mtu that's proper kiswahili yeah you don't feel somebody poleni unaweza mimi swa mimi na swa ulisoma school zone group nilisomea kwa whatsapp group ah and then look some appear na tegemea zawadi ni gani i don't know what that means exactly when you were songa please clarify that and as a fire yake ya silas jesus itabamba sana mhm you remember silas jesus we had him last saturday yeah coming up ah mike og zinking and as a i come how co interested mona on accept gift exactly mike people who are named mike are naturally intelligent you know oh, it's just a science Let, let's let's talk about that topic <laughs> a different day <laughs> and someone nothing is for free yo uh please nicheze chachisha by zinking okay mm -hmm. Uh Jim Lay Lelay, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Uh some hey show you could use sana ni Jemo from Nandi Hills and it's in Goma ya Tetema. Tetema. I'm tired of listening to Tetema. People I'm sorry. Love. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm tired too. It's one of those th songs yeah. really hit but then it gets played and played and overplayed. It's now like you are asleep at 9 a.m. Then on a square neighbor. Yeah. I have some Tetema uh, I know I, what's you're going like, on? What's Can we going on? <laughs> Sylvia Chemtea mm. sama zawadi haina tatizo shoka ndio tishio. Huh. I think she's referring to the tragic incident that happened with Ivy. Mm -hmm. That that was unfortunate. Um, and it looks like mtu akikupa zawadi sio mbaya. I'm I'm not so sure if I agree with this. Because every gift of we are human beings as much as we want to say people are good. Mm -hmm. There's always an ulterior motive. Yeah. Yeah. Like in and Luxor please uh, play fire yake yeah, yeah. Salas Jesus Pia and Samuel. Interesting. Keep those requests was... coming in and also answer that question we were asking is it right to take gifts or go on a date with someone you're not even interested in just to get mm -hmm. just yeah. to you know receive 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 receive. It's not right. And you're not and you know you're not going to give anything in return. Ha. Na so, Our next guest mm -hmm. actually our first guest goes by the name of Ronnie he's a spoken word artist and before we get into the interview i want you to do a piece for us okay so so wali niambia jesus is the rock so sitaji kuona reso ju hizo ujinga za john cena na kama life ni wrestling basi jesus ni descendant wa abel that's why kwa ring to corner king si ali take shida zangu akaziweka anda kwa hii life yendo undertaker na kama title sukuja na capital letters basi yeye alikuwa holy human and huge kwa hii life yendo triple h so ambia may where the pesa wisha akifika heaven asishtuke kuona christ amefungia bill gates si hakuhitaji kuwa na account ya twitter ndio tuweze kumfollow aliingia kwa temple devo karan tunaweza sema walikuwa watu wa kwanza kucheza temporan na miracles zake zilikuwa beyond human understanding usikia alifanya kipofu akakuwa eyewitness Sauta semaje you don't believe in him na hata watu wanaishi kwa desert wanajua Jesus reigns. So usiwayo kwa nguvu za giza ju hata wachawi wa kidhara unyota na mwezi asubuhi ikifika swatamjua. So kwa hii peace nataka kuongea kuhusu huu mtoto. Naongea kuhusu huu mtoto alizaliwa kwa nyumba ya kondoo lakini akakuwa simba wa Yuda. Naongea kuhusu huu mtoto alikuwa mtu wa kwanza kufungua shule ya Gumbaru, usikia alifundisha wazee kwa temple. So kwa hii peace nataka kuambia Hamas Lakewin. Ambia Hamas Lakewin wa siringe na hizo pati wameitwa. Jesus alikuwa anashinda na slippers, si alikuwa na pati pati. Aliingia kwa pati akapata walevi wameboeka, usikia aligeuza maji ikakuwa makali. So hata kama wako wanafanya so hata kama wako wanafanya kazi Nairobi water nasikia walikata maji viserious lakini baada hizi vitu zote bado walimsaliti nasikia walimuua wakamzika lakini hata kama hako wana kula mchele baada ya siku tatu si ali rise so he peace he peace imenifunza hii world iko full of fake people ndio nimejifunza kukula macho ya samaki ndio nione vitu fishi He peace imenifunza binadamu elewa vitu vi different walifikiria Mungu amekufa venye nilisema God ni mighty so wakikuuliza kunihusu waambie waambie mimi ule prophet alizaliwa kwa neighborhood ya Urasta so sihitaji kwenda secondary ndio ni my primary goals in life Ronnie Prince yeah 
No man, no man, no man, kabisa. Shukran. Shukran. Kwa hiyo peace ni kali sana. Shukran sana. Kwa nasikia na zirebu kwa kazi la vitu tunaza relate na za wapu ndani kukata maji. Ni pati gani mekubamba DJ Lil Russian? I was just amazed the whole time. I swear. Okay. I can't remember the lines. But yeah, they were just like, you know, zimengia. You connected with it somehow. Yeah. I like that, I like that. When did you get into this? As in because the way you were, you know, it's like he was engaging us directly, even though he was facing the camera. Yeah. You could see zoned already, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Because I'm not going to say, Yo confidence yote na out of experience mm. like i've been doing this for so long kitu sijaanza jana majuzi like it's been it's been almost it's been more than 5 years more than 5 years yeah, like and who are you looking up to before you started because when do it's not like you know you became a rapper i'm a yeah. singer songwriter yeah. you became a spoken word artist so definitely you had to have someone who was influencing you so who was it yeah, um, when I was starting spoken word poetry, uh, mostly nilikuwa nasikiza ma poets wa majuu sana sana. Um, Kuna mse anajitaga The Humble Beast. The Humble Beast. Eh, okay. Ni mrasta fulani hapo ni mdob sana. Kuna umde manajita Janet. Akupoa sana. Then um, locally, locally kuna ma poets kadhaa nilikuwa na look up to ni kianza. Um, those quizzes awako relevant sana. Mm. Yeah. But nilikuwa inspired sana sana ma poets wa majuu. Mm. Yeah. There's a uh, one and it was Prince EA. I like him a lot. Uh, you know him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you think about that type of uh, spoken word art? Uh, the way he uses social media uh, to convey his art. Because you know, most of the time when you speak to spoken word artists, yeah. they create events like the one we're going to talk about, Memories on the 28th. Yeah. But now, yeah, not to me, I social media to convey his messages. What do you think about that medium, Nablina, to make a squeeze? Um, it's a good thing, Sabu. Um, Kama naweza tumia kitu fulani ku reach a certain audience ama mm. a bigger audience then let me use it mm. like mini artist ndio yeye pia ni artist na sasa magam sana ni kiocha jamii sawa mm. so kama naweza tumia kitu fulani kama sasa yeye anatumia social media ku convey messages zake it's a good thing mm. sasa tuko digital era kila msako mm. ako pale hivi online na nini so Kenya anafanya ni poa umekuwa kwa craft for 5 years more than five years. More than five years. Yeah. So should I call it six or more five and a half? To get up to come more than five years. To take it up more than five years. Yeah, The challenge gani me face Ukianza and now as an established spoken word artist with your own events, which will be happening every first Sunday. Yeah. So the challenge gani me koke face. Okay, Nikianza kama kama performer kwanza nilikuwa na struggles za kupata gigs. Mm. Like kupata events, uitwe show, wendo perform ilikuwa hard sana Cause one, spoken word bado ni ata ijakuwa acknowledged sana Uwezi kompia na music, dance na nini, unapata mm. Mm. So like kulikuwa na hizo challenges za unasaka event, au party Ama ata mm. ukipati wa event, uona kuja show kama Uona kama kama others, unapata So ata kama uh, kuna, kuna Kwa hivyo kuna performers Kuna performers, then sasa kuna nyi eh, Sasa nyi mkapo kwa <laughs> others eh. uh. So unapata inakuja mpaka design ya Kama kuna some sort of appreciation Kama kuna payment na nini uh. Kenya nyi mtalipo kama spoken word artist uh. Na kenya ase watalipo Unapati wa bus fare, eh, unapati wa ingini Ama ata mostly nyi mna mbiwa buda Kujia nisho unapati ya platform and that's that. That's crazy. Actually, yeah. I think uh, even with musicians who are upcoming, yeah. that's the conversation. I hear people who are saying, even DJs, uh, even DJs apparently, DJs any type of entertainer that you end on a lipwa, na uh, what's it called? Platform. Exposure. Exposure. Yeah, that's to come crazy. Come and play or like do your set. Yeah. No, no, no. Here at Y254, we do not believe that. That's why we say hashtag talent nikazi because we believe in you know uplifting whatever craft. You, Whatever imagination, whatever your mind is carrying you, kuna, kuna, there's a purpose to it, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. Now you're an established spoken word artist. You're creating all these you know, nice pieces. Yeah. So there's memories. We're going to talk about that uh, later on. But okay. now, 2019, the may happen politically. Uh, even in our morning conversation, I believe you had it as well. Yeah. You know, in relationships, men and women. Well, on a year to influence now your, you know, your structure and the way you create your poems for 2019. Um, yeah, definitely. It, uh, it uh, influence the, the big sana cause. Um, me, kama, kama writer, <coughs> whenever I write a piece, wagatusi andiki piece kubamba wase, unapata. Like, 
mupata inspiration from day to day happenings mm. unapata kenye kita happen leo kama ni kitu yenyewe kitu yenyewe itaniguza sana mm. lazima nitaandika something about it mm. kama ni kitu itani itani boat yani so since siwezi mimi si politician na tenta kuja kwa TV pale hivi niongee nini nini mm. but there's a rich crowd flani through my spoken word mm. nitaandika about it mm. so kama hizi stuff zimekuwa ziki happen lately stories as due as eku madwa nini vitu kama hizo hizo ni stuff sisi si kama artist tunafaa kuzi address through at z tunapata mm. so 2019 definitely most of my pieces zitakuwa about vitu zina happen real time in real time yeah so uh, uh we had a conversation earlier today okay we, we were asking is it right to accept gifts when you know you're not interested in that person we have you know it's 2019 yeah. so what do you think through the eyes of a poet what's your answer okay i think this thing goes both sides like is it okay to accept something from someone maybe mwenye ako interested kwako nawe auko interested kwake mm. for example tuseme mimi ka sponsor red design mm. alafu sasa um super namtaka kweli na mm. maybe ayuko poor financially but ako na mahitaji mm. unapata mm. then mimi ni approach design za eh ni aje niko interested na wewe nini nini then nianze kum kumjenga do nianze kumfund mm. unajua zile mahitaji zake sometimes uh, problems zetu zu to over cloud unakosa mm. kuona the bigger picture you mm. just see the money na venye hiyo itakusaidia itakusaidia, itakusaidia eh. mm. so sometimes ina go back to society ikoaje unapata ndio mdem kama maybe huyu mm. anze maybe ku na sponsor ya design ya pate ganji mm. kuna venye society ili fail ada akiwa mdo mm. akiwa mdogo ndio venye ana kama that's a viable option yeah Pia, uh, so kupenda kwao uh, most of the times uh, then for the men pia men work hard for their money uh, unapata machele yenye su, su hustle mm. then unapata ganji unapata mdem then baadaye anakutoka mm. unajua kuna kale ka feeling eh those system ni poa kuenda to an extreme measure ku take mpaka life i'm say mm. yeah nothing is worth dying for mm. unapata mm. but society inafaa ku change society inafaa inafa ku change yeah. but your answer is no it's not right it's not right mm. yeah It's not right. It's not right. I will need to close it. Relax, relax, relax. <laughs> Now there's memories uh, an event you're organizing it's going to happen every first Sunday. Yeah. Uh, the first one it occurred this month. Is it the first one? Yeah, it's the first edition on the 28th of this 28th, month. On the 28th, yeah. I uh, will tell us about memories who's going to be there for this edition on the 28th. Okay. And what it's all about. Okay, memories is a uh, I don't want to call it a platform for artists. It's a it's a creative space mm. for artists. Unapata? So ni show yenye na bring up na bring together my artists when you a different kind of arts. Kutakuwa na spoken word, kutakuwa na rap, kutakuwa na comedians. Mm. Unapata? Mm. So for this edition it's all about spoken word, comedy and rap. And rap. Unapata, yeah. Ah, but so um the reason why niliamua kuweka memories. Mm. First of all the The inspiration behind memories is that since I'm an artist, tukiwa pale this stage, secret memories mob sana. Mm. Artist anaweza come a pig piece, a perform like a kwache uki think kitu hata uje fikiria unaweza think hivyo unapata. Mm. So hizo memories the name artist will create wakiwa stage. So hizo ndio zilifanya ni kazi. Nikachukua hiyo idea nikaita show yangu memories. memories eh. nice. The second thing is that um nikianza kama spoken word artist, nimekuwa mbili kwa hard kupata ma gigs. Mm. Sawa? nime like nime chapa chapa masho say at least na sema niko established kiasi stacky my points when you want to come mm. wapitie the same thing and you need such a challenge when yeah. you're coming up in the industry exactly industrial. so that's when i'm at least nianze na memories nianze kupatia ama at least wengine wenye wana come mm. at least your your chance ya ku show the world what they have mm. na wa grow to brands down na sisi wote to grow pamoja so na i like that i like yeah. that unajua uh, this is what we always talk about You know when you make it at a come out make it kabisa grab someone's hand and pull them up they'll end yeah. up pushing you even further up our oh, vp yeah. i like that Ronnie prince yeah. uh spoken word pieces are on kali sana watu wanazizipata youtube yeah okay for now bado sijaziaka kwa mtandao niko studio mm. na wakia album yangu ya kwanza mm -hmm. nitai drop around hii mwaka ikeleka kuisha mm -hmm. yeah so for now niko studio bado yeah Nice. Kuzi... Lakini watu wanaweza ku follow up on social media. Yeah, on social media. Wana taka this information about memories and I've let to happen every first Sunday. Yeah, um on Facebook, Ronnie Prince, Instagram, Ronnie Prince Poet. 
Twitter squaggy huko sana mm. but kwa hizo platforms mbili Kwa nini? Eh? Kwa nini? Eh hey, mzee Twitter jo sijui. Siko tu huko sana. <laughs> Sikwagi tu huko sana. Mm. So in case unataka kujua more about memories, mm. unaweza nipata kwa Facebook Ronnie Prince, mm. IG Ronnie Prince Poet. Mm. So memories itakuwa go down e month 28th. Mm. Sarakasi do mapongara. Advance tickets ni 300, entrance kwa gate itakuwa 500. Come to support art na kila kitu itakuwa fresh. Yeah. Fresh kabisa. Now uh, we're about to finish with the Another piece, another beautiful piece from Ronnie Prince. But before that, yes. I want to give you a challenge. Okay. Let's do any poet, huh? Yeah. Na kuna my boy children or koko in your money, I just cook at your madam, one of Kira cook at your dam. Your money topic may come, one of Kira cook at your dam, the compatia. My gun, my gun, my gun. That's not my dam, I just cook at your boy, like any, it's not your fault. Yeah. <laughs> so, what does that mean, him super? Yes. Um, um, patia to underline him super. Billy. Line in billing your books. Yeah. Challenge. Accepted or not? Accepted. Sir. Uh -huh. <laughs> What's your box? <laughs> so, <coughs> some super. Niliske ukisemati all men are dogs. I agree. Can I be your puppy? Eh. Rambo. Niliambi wa love can move mountains. Ndomana penzi langu kwa kwa ni kama volcano. Cause baby you are my lover. Hey. Na tangu tupendane mimi na wewe tuko pamoja kama jubili Juroho yangu meinasa Hata hey. hey. maika mingia box Russian is just here turning I red I love no. it, I love it, I love it I, I, I'm like, okay, shika tu namba <laughs> Shiko <laughs> namba muda <laughs> Nice, nice, nice Hey, Roni yeah, That was awesome Thanks, Thanks, man. Thanks, This no. is Roni Prince Yeah so let, let's start with a piece from Ronnie. Okay, so this is my last piece. Yo, <coughs> Aliza liwa kwa nyumba ya matope, ndio mana alikuwa mad na maisha. Alitamani kulala kwa bed sita. Na at the age of 15, alikuwa na six boyfriends, ya likuwa shana liya bed sitter. Alitama ni kuwa gana sabuni ya geisha ama life boy. Ungedha ni ange katwa katwa ange ugana sabuni ya panga. Na aliacha shule ya kiwa darasa la sita, kanza kuchora saba. Alikuwa na figa namba nane, angefanya vijana wa kupigetisa. Ange ingia kanisani urembo wake ungefanya hata mapasta watu efungu la kumi. So hata kama alizaliwa maringo, Umstana alikuwa na bahati angetembea kayole si hata wakora wa dandora wange ya huruma vijana walimuita queen akakuwa na mentality ya utawala alikuwa na rangi ya kahawa na utamwaskari ningeulizwa pale ametoka haki ya Mungu ningesema hu mrembo ametoka kahawa skari na akuwa anapenda kuvuta so haungempata kario bangi alifanya vijana wapelekwe madhare juu wengi aliwachizisha Unge mwangalia nyuma alikuwa mejibeba, unge dhani anafanya kazi si underhouse. Unge ingia kwa, unge ingia kwa bafu yake alikuwa na sabuni zote, unge dhani alizaliwa all soaps. Alikuwa napenda vako za langata, na huko ndi alipatana na the wrong guy, haka muntro kwa pombe. Unge ingia kwa nyumba yake, unge dhani anaishi na ndovu, venya alikuwa mejaza tembo. Ali define happiness na pombe, haka lose focus kwa life na hii siku. Hii siku alianza kukunywa pombe, roi sambu, na kabla fike githurai, eh, si alizima man. Unge muangalia, unge dhani amekatiwa stima na Kenya power, venya yeah, so alichu blackout. Ali define happiness na pombe, haka lose focus kwa hii life, sai, the only thing.